Okay. Welcome back to my version of the Newman motor. This time I'm running it all the way through with my two batteries. One battery is that one and the other one is that one. The one is driving one side of it and this one is driving upside of it. So this is how it looks on the scope. You can really see this is one input, this is the other input and you see all these hairy spikes and that's what I think is the reason why my meters especially this one even when I put it on the highest you can't handle it and this is an AC from the other battery AC is not possible because the AC comes not from the battery so this is coming from the motor and that's really 300 to 400 volts you see pulse and that's this this spike is like you see you see all this Harry spikes here is what is explaining why my meter is not working here from the one battery. Sometimes you see flipping. Also, six stuff. This is what I think the motor is pulling from one battery, but I don't know if it's arms that is pulled back to the battery so uh, if I put this one on uh, here you can see also in AC over in DC even shows this weird voltage range even when I put it on the high voltage you will see very 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 big big back spikes so for now I put it here in the AC Uh, sometimes my motor is making a little bit noise, but because of that noise, you get all these back spikes. But I can play a bit with this in the here, it goes directly up. Very nice speed now. You can really not see the speed of this motor, but you can hear it a bit, and you can see it here on my scope. When I take away both of the commentators, I can see again which voltage I am. And this battery is still 1274. And this one 1285. So, the next time when I uh, make another movie, I will show the battery again. And from now I'm going to run it again. This is only one.
And then we can put the other one. And you can see it on the scope going up. Also, you can see my meat is going totally wet on it. You can maybe hold the motor a little bit. And you see that the back spikes are coming back from this motor. At this speed, and I'm, I'm, I'm keeping it with my fingers to let it roll smaller, slower. I let it go, it goes directly. And also the animators cannot hold it anymore. So, even on the AC, I cannot really see what's happening here. Uh, This one, if I put it back on the AC, you will see. And it's still a bit noisy. So I'm going to adjust the uh, commutator to see if I can get a better sound. Uh, the meters are giving faults. Sounds weird, but if you can see the back spikes here, it's really there, you know. Not a bunch of hairy stripes. So I'm gonna adjust my commutator again. <laughs> 